In this video, we'll add a geolocated swatch of land to SketchUp so that you can place your building on it. First, we'll need to download two extensions from the Extension Warehouse. The first one is Add Location. Click and then install it. And once you install it, it will show up under File. The second one you need is the Eneroth Terrain Volume. And here it is. And once you install it, it will show up under Extensions. So let's click on File, Add Location, and then type whatever location you want. I'm going to type Estes Park. Be aware that there isn't terrain information for every location that you might want to pick. Let's drop the pin right there and click Continue. Now I will hone in on the exact swatch of land I want. Make sure that 3D Mesh is selected and then Import Site Content and Close. And here it is. This is just the photo image. You often have to go to the Tags folder and then find the terrain that you imported and turn it on. So I have the flat photo and then I have the imported mesh here. It comes in as a locked group, so right click and choose Unlock. And then you can go in and edit this group or you can explode it. So I just exploded it and I'm going to delete the flat photo because I don't need it and I have just the mesh. I would like to add volume to this. So while this group is selected, I will click on Extensions, Eneroth Terrain Volume, and presto, it just added volume. And it's an arbitrary depth, so I can push pull it up to make it a bit shorter. And there is that swatch of land geolocated, and I can put a model on it.